A24 has released the new trailer for Green Room, the latest from Blue Ruin director Jeremy Saulnier. In Green Room, Patrick Stewart plays a diabolical club owner who squares off against an unsuspecting but resilient young punk band. Stewart's role as a neo-Nazi leader of a white supremacist group has been earning him rave reviews for the film, which also stars Anton Yelkin and Imogen Poots. The movie will hit theaters this April 29th. Christian Beyer sell the new trailer for Green Room. I buy it because I'm curious to see... Pat, uh, Patrick Stewart being a an evil bastard. Mm-hmm. I kind of want to see him do that. We know we always every time we see him, whether it's Professor X or if he's in Star Trek, we, we he's he's always, he's the good guy. He's the guy that it makes you feel calm. But this one is the opposite. Uh, so I, it's got that creepy independent film. A twenty four is doing a lot of great things mm-hmm. right now. So for me, I'm going to buy this trailer. Schnapp. Yeah, I buy it too. I loved Blue Ruin. So and, and then I saw this trailer. This is the second trailer for Green Room. It's just got that suspense. It's like a small film. You, obviously, the setup is a band gets locked right. in, a bunch of skinheads surround them. Are they going to escape? That's the rest of the film. It looks creepy. It looks tonally like a really good film. I'm interested to see what his next film is going to be called because he had Blue Ruin and this is Green Room. Is it going to be like Red Reason or what the hell? It's going to have red in the title, is my guess, or yellow. I, I swear to God. But uh, yeah, I buy this trailer. The Red Rocker, a Sammy Hagar biopic. What I think it's going to be is, yeah, you get to see Patrick Stewart in there and he looks cool as the neo Nazi. It's a very different version of a shaved head. I think that the chemistry between Yelkin and Poots, who were really good together in uh, the Fright Night remake, they mm, were both in that. Right. And so seeing them here together, this is a kind of a cool premise that it looks like it's not going to be too torture porny, which was what I was fearing going in. It looks mm-hmm. like it's going to have a cool story to balance out some of the violence that you will end up getting in a movie like this. So I'm buying this trailer big time. Uh, the majority of you guys are buying this trailer big time as well. I would say from the, I've seen a lot of buys that looks interesting it looks something different from Stewart. someone says it looks like a shit bucket but there's a lot of people <laughs> that are saying nice. that for, uh, the majority i would say bye 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 does so, it look like the uh, does it look like the stock market when you're looking at it like just everybody tells yeah you, no this bye, is this kind of why i wanted to do it because everyone kind of chimes in i think that the second she says buy or sell we see what the audience the, this the, the opinion you brought is. up the wolf of wall street you're pretending you're that guy now i just want to see mm-hmm. those old guys from trading places <laughs> bye <Yeah>. bye <laughs> bye <laughs> Hey guys, if you like this clip, click here to watch the entire episode. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel because it'll help you stay up to date with all the stuff we've got going on here at Collider.